Hello YouTube, my name is Trey, welcome to What Can I Change? Today we're gonna to be talking about Little Tay. Is it true or is it not true? Before we start, if you, you know, if you like this content, go ahead and like it. You wanna subscribe after watching this? Go ahead and subscribe, go ahead and do it. But if you don't, it's cool. Okay, also you can donate down here if you like. This, all the money goes back to the production set. Always trying to make things better here, look nice and tidy. I appreciate y'all. Okay, so, <laughs> so I'm reading into this Little Tay thing, right? And what we are seeing, and we're going to go ahead and read the thing on it. Hold on, let me pull it up right quick. Some people are saying that she passed away. You see this on people.com. So let's go ahead and open that up. The rapper and influencer Little T.D. has reportedly died at the age of 14. On Wednesday, a statement was shared on Instagram her account. Uh, of the incident, internet personality born Claire Hope announcing her death. It was then confirmed to Variety by her management. People has been unable to verify the news. So it's unverified. It is with a heavy heart that we share a devastating news that our beloved Claire's sudden and tragic passing. The statement shared that to Hope's 3.3 followers said, we have no words to express the unbearable loss and uh, indescribable pain. This outcome was entirely unexpected and left us all in shock. This post allegedly made by her family said that her brother, Jason Titan, also died. The cause of death is still under investigation, according to the statement. Instagram, the Instagram continued. Her brother's passing adds even more unimaginable depth to our grief. During this time of immense sorrow, we kindly ask for privacy. And you know what's crazy? That they're asking for privacy, even though she has been irrelevant for at least five years. 2018 was really the last thing we ever heard from her. She's been gone, no posts, I ain't seen no videos about her, nothing. So what do you mean, give it privacy? We wouldn't have known if you hadn't said nothing. Nobody would even know. I don't remember anybody saying, man, what's going on with Lil Tay? I don't think even people even look into her. I haven't seen no documentaries on her because the last documentary we saw on her was really back in 2018 when she disappeared. She's a little girl. Let's not forget she's nine. She, she was nine at the time. And now she's allegedly 14. So let her live her life. She's a teenager. Ain't, I don't want to be looking into a teenage girl's life. But, I mean, it's kind of weird. But the post allegedly made by her family, Jason, the call that that's done. The Instagram continued. Uh, we already read all that. During the time of the Miss Sorrow, we asked for privacy as we grieve this overwhelming loss. As the circumstances surrounding Claire and her brother's passing are still under investigation. Claire will be forever, will, will forever remain in our, our hearts. Her absence and leaving our irreplaceable void that we felt by all who knew and loved her, the post said. Lil Tay went viral in 2018 at the age of nine this is this, with her essential videos. By the way, when she went on, uh, when she got famous, we all found out that uh, it was her brother that was doing this. So it says right here, uh, in 2019, Tay's brother, starting at the age of 16, or orchestrated much of her social media president, uh, presence. The pair, as well as the mother, uh, Angela Titan, were said to have accused a great deal of confusion. This is all 2018. 2019, I think she had pretty much gone by then. See, uh, her Instagram has not been active since June 28, uh, 2018. With this last post being contributed to SSX as a father figure when I don't have one. I don't know if X should be your father figure, but you know. And that was it. Pretty much gone. And so when we come over here back to X, from, you know, our great Thermiri, rumors are circulating that Claire Elite Queen Hope, better known as Lil TJ, has passed away along with her brother. However, her former manager is casting doubts about her reports of her death, saying she, he says, he can neither confirm nor deny that he is just isn't another publicity stunt. Either way, the last thing I remember about hearing about the little girl were disturbing claims of family abuse. Yes, we... And the whole thing is just awful. The numerous ways the little girl was exploited and used by her parents. See, the thing that came out was her brother was the one orchestrating the whole thing. And then it came out that her mother was behind the brother. And so that's where it pushes into this. And so what I think, man, and I'm this is a short video because I don't know, but we will continue to look into this. What I believe is that the mother and them all did this and they were already known for abuse, then there's possibly some foul play. But I don't want to speculate because she could have. It said it's under investigation, so we know it wasn't a natural call. Not like she died from something naturally. If they wouldn't be investigating something like that, so we're gonna go see what's going on, and hopefully um, we can get into the, the depths of this. But to me, it sounds like this story is about to get super dark. We're gonna stick on it. Um, if y'all hear anything, send it to my Twitter. Let me know. If y'all see anything that I don't see, I'm gonna try to keep looking into it, and we'll continue with this Amiri video as well tomorrow. I hope y'all have a 
great night. Thank you for watching. Leave something in the comment section down below. If y'all have any updates, um, send it to me once again in my Twitter DMs. I'm more likely to see that than my comments because once again, I put out so many video guys, I can't see all the comments. So please send it to my Twitter if you actually find something new. Okay? Appreciate y'all. Bye.